it's that wonderful time of year where we have winter and spring sports <laughs> overlapping, so there's a lot going on. For the rifle team, it's the start of their postseason. The number two cats posted an impressive NCAA qualifying score Saturday, their third best of the season. The cats' three top aggregate scores used for qualifying averaged out to 47-43. I don't know if that's a good shorthand for that. That's just <laughs> behind Alaska Fairbanks' top average score of 47 50, but maybe that's the chip this Kentucky team needs on their shoulders heading into the postseason. Is it tough every year going to try to win a national championship? Sure. But I feel these guys are definitely in the hunt this year. Uh, we've got great talent on the team, and they've really been working well. You know, they're a little tired with all the things they've done between Will and Mary, but we're trying to find a little bit of that energy towards the end to push us over the edge, and I'm excited to see what the next three weeks brings. Conference championships are this weekend in New York, and then NCAA championships get started March 11th in Colorado. SEC championships wrapped up for the league's swimming and diving programs. Kentucky's women finished runner-up. That's their second highest finish behind last year's first place, of course, while the men's program finished eighth. Throughout the meet, the Cats won three gold medals, three silver, and nine bronze. They set ten school records and one SEC record, plus earned nine NCAA automatic qualifying cuts. So those Wildcats will compete again in March. And how about Riley Gaines winning the 200 fly, setting a new SEC meet and conference record? The Kentucky baseball team got the weekend sweep over Jacksonville State on opening weekend. The Cats won 10 to 8. 6-2 and then a 15-1 offensive explosion on Sunday led by senior infielder Jake Plastiak. Kentucky's next opponent will be a surprise matchup against Bellarmine on Wednesday at 4 thanks to expected heavy rains canceling tomorrow's matchup with Southeast Missouri. UK softball went 5-0 over the weekend at the Helen Brand Invitational in Tucson, Arizona, including a major statement win 7-6 over number 11 Arizona. It was senior Kennedy Sullivan who was the hero of the day. She hit a two-run home run in the top of the fifth inning to score the eventual game-winning run. Next up for the 9-1 Wildcats is a trip to Boca Raton, Florida for the FAU Strikeout Cancer Classic. Two games Thursday, two Friday, and one on Saturday. Josh Pascal may be done wearing a Kentucky uniform, but that doesn't mean he's done repping the Cats or making BBN proud. He recently accepted the Jason Witten Collegiate Man of the Year Award. Here's a look back at that night and his emotional acceptance speech. Yeah, it means a lot uh, just knowing what the award is, uh, the Jason Wynn Collegiate Man of the Year Award. And Jason Wynn himself, he's such a great, a great man, a great man of character, a great man of leadership. And so to be honored with an award in his name and his recognition, that means the world. The 2021. Jason Witten, Collegiate Man of the Year winner is... Joshua Pascal, Kentucky. I want to say thank you to Jason and for the committee for choosing me, but I also want to say uh, congrats to Grant and congrats to Patrick as well because they're outstanding young men. Uh, we have an obligation to lead from here on going forward, and you know that's what we're going to do. Uh, we have to pass this on and pay it forward, just like Jason said. I want to say thank you to my dad, my mom, my sister, my brother, and my two coaches, uh, Coach White and Coach Stu for coming out, and my agent, Alex. Uh, you know, I have an amazing support system. Um, that's one thing. To get somewhere like this, you have to have people behind you. And I've been blessed by the Lord with such great leaders to look up to in college. You know, to be a great leader, you have to be, you have to be a follower at one point. And I've learned from the best, and I'm beyond thankful for this award. I'm thankful for you guys for this event tonight. And like I said, all glory goes to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you. Congratulations, Josh. We're so proud of you. Congrats on winning Man of the Year. We always knew you were. Congratulations, dude. I won this award. You've always been a little bit of a better guy than me, so this doesn't surprise me, but I'm very happy for you, bro. You deserve this. Just want to say congratulations. Could not be more proud of you. Um, you know, you represent everything you do is, uh, is the right way. Congratulations, man. So proud of you. Man of the year. That's huge, man. Keep Continue to do what you do. Go hard and uh, represent us well, man. Love you. 
My brother, congratulations, man. I'm proud of you. Keep going hard. Hey, you almost there. Keep going, baby. Congrats, my boy. I'm very proud of you. You still have no rhythm, but you're a great guy and I'm proud of you. Congratulations, Josh. We're so proud of you. Go Cats! More BBN Tonight is right after this.